I'm Dr. Anil Narsinghe, Assistant Professor in the Department of Microbiology, Yogeshwari Mahavidyala, Ambajogai. Friends, in this video, we are going to show you the demonstration of the experiment that is MPN. So, what is MPN? So, MPN it is the most probable number. It is used for the microbiological analysis of water. It is a type of quantitative analysis of water. And it is used to check the quality of the water. It is used to check the potability of the water. So, whether the given water sample it is safe or not. So, with the help of this method, we are going to ensure that whether the sample, a given sample of the water, it is potable, it is safe for drinking purpose or not. And it is one of the most commonly used method in the microbiology laboratory and it is found to be the one of the easiest methods. MPN it is used for detection of the coliform that is fecal coliform in the water sample that is E. coli and it is also used for the enumeration of the fecal coliform present in the given water sample. So depending on the presence of coliform so that will indicate the quality of that given water sample. So the coliform, so what is mean by coliform? So coliform they are referred to as the organisms which are gram negative, which are rod shape, which are aerobic, which are facultative anaerobic, which are non spore forming bacilli and that ferment lactose sugar at 37 degrees Celsius within 24 hours and such kind of organism they are referred to as coliform. So E. coli which is the normal inhabitant of our intestine which is most commonly found in our intestine and that is found to be one of the friendly bacteria. As this E. coli it is found in our intestine because it is the normal inhabitant of our intestine it belongs to the enteric group of the bacteria it belongs to the enterobacteriaceae family and depending on the presence of this E. coli, depending on the presence of fecal coliform in the given water sample, we can check the potability of the water. Well, these fecal coliforms, they are referred to as index of water pollution, that is indicator of water pollution or indicator of the fecal contamination of the water. And depending on the presence of these fecal coliform, we can check the quality of the water. If it is present in a more number in the given water sample so that will give the high probability that the water sample may contain the disease causing microorganism. So as the bacteria E. coli is found in our intestine so it is the enteric group of the bacteria so other members of the enteric group of the bacteria and the pathogens they are salmonella typhi which causes typhoid fever, vibrio cholerae which causes cholera and many other types of the pathogens they are also present in the intestine and if there is a detection of the E. coli that is fecal coliform in the given water sample and the presence of this E. coli is more in number that is an indication that the water is fecally polluted and that water it is found to be not suitable for the drinking purpose it is not potable. If the number of this fecal coliform in the given water sample it is very less that will give indication that the water sample it is safe for drinking. So depending on this MPN we can check the potability of the water and we can enumerate, we can estimate the number of fecal coliform present in the given water sample.